Hey guys, uh, just got back from CVS. This is a really small haul, I'm not gonna lie. There weren't a lot of deals that I personally wanted to take advantage of, but I just wanted to show you what I came home with. I ended up saving 98% on this receipt. So let me just show you the two quick deals that I took home. So first we have Colgate Manual Toothbrush. It was $3.99 in the circular. And um, when you bought it, there was a dollar off coupon in the newspaper from I think 617 I don't have it written down I'm sorry and then you got two dollars extra care bucks so that makes this 99 cents once you take it home and then there were um, speed sticks buy one get one free coupon in the 610 paper this is when you have to start being in it for a little bit I told you uh, three videos ago that once you start staying with me, my first week I saved about 50%, my second week I saved about 70%, and now I'm at the 90, in the 90% mark, and that's because I'm starting to accumulate a lot of coupons. So I had the 610 newspaper, and I had a buy one, get one free coupon for Speed Stick, and it was um, $2 extra care buck when you buy two. So they were $3.69 and then $1.84. I got $2 back and that made these $0.84 cents each. Now when I went to CVS, I checked the kiosk because select shoppers were able to get a $2 off six um, soft soap body wash and I really wanted to take advantage of that because they were also giving you three dollars extra care bucks if you bought the soft soap this week but unfortunately I wasn't one of those select shoppers so I couldn't take advantage but you should definitely check the kiosk because if you get the two dollar off six soft soap body wash coupon from CVS you will purchase them it's a two for seven deal this week You'll purchase them, you get the two for six off, you get $3 back, and they're a, as low as $1 each after stacking that all together. So that's a really great deal for um, soft soap body wash and soft body wash, deodorant, toothpaste, toothbrushes. These are all things that I definitely look to stack up. Some deals that I did not go after, lots of makeup deals right now. If you go to CBS, there's a L'Oreal deal, there's a Rimmel deal for eye makeup, there's an e.l.f. deal for um, eyeshadow, pencils, and even brushes. And to be really honest with you, I don't need that stuff. I have a ton of makeup, I'm a beauty blogger, and I get all that stuff sent to me. So personally, I don't need those products. Um, if you need those products, you should definitely look on livingrichwithcoupons.com and she'll show you how to take advantage of those deals. Personally, I just didn't need them. That's why I came in real small this week because it just wasn't something that I personally needed. So coming in all in, I will show you I had to get a extra care buck printed out separately because I always tell you guys you have to check your receipts. It doesn't guarantee that the people will 100% get everything done right. My uh, Colgate extra care buck, um, extra bucks did not print up. So I had to go back in and I had to show him that it didn't print up. So luckily they were quick enough to just print up a $2 extra care buck on the side so I uh, my total price out of pocket was two dollars and thirteen cents I saved twelve dollars and twenty four cents my total savings was ninety eight percent so all in I took home fourteen dollars and fifty cents worth of goods basically paid two dollars and thirteen cents and I have six dollars in new extra care bucks. However, I still have from last week because I haven't had a chance to spend them yet. Four, five, six, ten, twelve dollars left from last week because this is such a small haul. So I have, I already forgot what I said, six, ten, twelve dollars plus the six dollars that I got from here. So next week I have um, $18 worth of extra care bucks that I'm going to be able to spend next week and hopefully I'll be able to take home a lot more than just deodorant and toothbrushes. But I want to show you slow and steady wins the race. I'm not upset that I didn't get to take home a ton of stuff. It just wasn't the right sales for me and that's a really big lesson that I want to tell you guys. Don't go in and just see, okay guys, oh wow, five for 20 and I'll get five extra care bucks back if I buy th these candles and you don't 
don't really need candles like don't get caught up in that I didn't need the makeup so I didn't go in and go after the makeup and I think that that's smart couponing so I only needed this little stuff and that's what I'm gonna show you guys and hopefully next week I can come back with something bigger laundry stuff you know things like that that's what I want to go after home goods uh, the, the home goods and the bath stuff is the stuff that I'm really focusing on they did also have a, a cereal sale that I think was a value all in I think you can get the cereal for like a dollar eighty eight and I think that's a good price but we just did a huge BJ's run and literally I have so much cereal that it wouldn't even have been worth it for me to do that either so that's my story and I'm sticking to it I hope you guys have a good CVS run if you want more ideas than that just this again go to livingrichwithcoupons.com she gives you some more ideas and I will see you next time bye